I'm curious. Earlier you said rest in peace, Chris Dorner. Now his his I feel like his story and his manifesto. I feel like that's such an interesting uh, topic that doesn't get brought up enough because I do feel like it's kind of like depending on your perspective on it. I mean, obviously nobody should ever condone like people dying and stuff, but I, mm. but. I, I always was thinking in my head, I was like, man, I wonder if anybody will ever tackle that topic from like a conceptual way through hip hop, whether it's a record, whether it's telling that story, maybe. I can, I'll keep you in the game. I can't throw it for you, Kev, but we definitely did bring something up like that on the record. I appreciate you saying that. Yeah, because I feel like you would be the guy to do it. I'm the guy that did it already. Okay. It's coming out. And I, I, but I mean, like I said, we don't do gratuitous violence. We talk about what it is in terms of what that exposes, right? The fact that people were so scared of him that they decided to shoot other people that weren't even him. The fact that they were like, okay, you actually have documented files. And we heard testimony from the city council and so many racist things they said. Chris Dorner allegedly had documents and recordings of high-level people in the LAPD and government saying things that were probably just as bad, if not worse. Yeah. So I think that there's a lot of sketch that's around him. There's other people in that are in my proximity that I've had a similar experience with that I'll say, okay, I went to Penn State University, right? Mm -hmm. And around the same time when the sexual molestation allegations were going on Sandusky. against Sandusky mm -hmm. that other coaches knew there was a district attorney who was the district attorney in my case as a matter of fact when I went to prison um, his name was Ray Grecar and he was investigating the Sandusky stuff and guess what he was disappeared they found his his he's still gone he was he was he was declared missing what? like and he's declared dead you can look his name up ray grecar g r i c a r and they found his laptop missing a hard drive in a fucking lake or like in a river like a little stream like a mile away from his house so this guy who was investigating who could have possibly covered up the rape allegations gave whoever it was cover enough for them to blame only the people who got caught and none of the giant donors from Penn State who partook the in the circle too. Yeah, that's Hey man, crazy. I, I'm not going to stop talking about this. So if something happens to me, we all know what it is. <laughs>